Today is another exciting video. I am going to show you my Louis Vuitton mini pochette. It is not brand new. Um, I'll tell you the details of it later. With all my receipts and everything important in there. And that's it there. And here we are. This is my mini pochette. As you can see, it's a little bit different. It has these nice um, artwork here. So it is actually a limited edition uh, 2018. It was a Christmas animation edition that they, they put out. Um, so that's why it has like special prints on it. Um, the rest of it is in the regular monogram canvas this mini pochette usually comes in in other prints as well so it comes in damier azure and a damier a bin but as i mentioned this is the monogram the regular monogram um, gold hardware on the chain the animation i chose is of these cats so i got this one in store um, this bag is really hard to find online sometimes. It's a hit or miss. So I'd say go in your local uh, Louis Vuitton store and have a look. If you can't find it online, go in store and they might have it. I really like this. It's really pretty. But anyway, <laughs> so it has this gold torn hardware uh, that you can see here. And it detaches like this. So this way you can use it as a wristlet and just like carry the little bag like this or you can carry it like this. Some people do carry it just in the crook of their arm just like that. Um, so far I've not used this bag a lot, not because it's not really good, it's just I was just trying to preserve it. I would use it typically in my handbags um, as a catch-all or to carry, you know, some feminine stuff that I want to carry around or just um, use it to dash out of the car to go in the store or whatever I want to use it for. It is so cute. It has this red leather piece or whatever it's written. Louis Vuitton Paris made in France and it has this interior the red interior it's very soft inside so let's talk measurements so the length is 15.5 centimeters which is 6.1 inches and the height is 10.5 centimeters which is 4.1 inches the width is four centimeters which is 1.6 inches it is such a cute cute bag now let's quickly see what fits in it the zip glides perfectly it has the um, natural carhide leather trim and the textile lining as i showed you earlier it's a great small leather good from Louis Vuitton, I mean, it has multiple functions, whatever you can use it for to better your lifestyle, then do so. But for me, I, I really just use it to put random things that I want to put in my bag, just so my bag is organized. Or if I want to get up and go or leave my bag somewhere, I will just take this specifically out of the bag um, and go out with it keeps my bag organized and it keeps um, things like lipstick if it spills you know it doesn't damage my bag because you know my bags are more expensive than this so with this size you can see that it is definitely smaller than my toiletry 19 as you can see here the size of the mini pochette is comparable to my um, mini old pouch from chanel as you can see right there but um, i would say more things will fit in the mini pochette than this pouch because of the width 
The width here is four centimeters, which I mentioned um, is 1.6 inches, but on the mini pouch for from Chanel, it's only one centimeter. So it doesn't really allow a lot of stretching room or um, you can't really fit as much in here as you would in here. So that's the slight advantage of having the mini pochette instead of the Chanel pouch. Of course, they have bigger pouches at Chanel, but um, specifically in terms of size, I would say this mini size is most comparable to the mini pochette. So let's see what fits in here. We have a key fob. That's it there. Let's say two lip products. This is Red Sea from Colored Rain. Okay, so if you really want to know specifically what I'm putting here, um, I'll put that in the description below. Or if I don't, let me know in the comment section um, that you wanted to see it. So yeah, anyway, so lip products in there, a little perfume. Let's say some wet wipes. I've got gum. AirPod Pro. No, it doesn't look like it'll close. What do I need to take out? Let's take out some lip products. Stuff it right at the bottom. Okay, so that's it there. And we are able to close it with not too much worry. As you can see, there's space here. Um, I could have packed that better, but you know. Um, let's say on this particular day, we don't need gum. We need hand sanitizer. That's a must. <laughs> so we've got to fit it in there. So let's take out the AirPods and put our hand sanitizer. Then we are good to go. I can also fit my Louis Vuitton card case in here and we are able to close it still. Of course, maybe you can do a better job of packing and it will close with all our essentials. Um, and it says Louis Vuitton there. Did I show you that? No, but that's my mini pochette, uh, the limited edition animation <laughs> collection. Isn't it cute? I really like it. It fits in my handbags fine. And this strap, this chain is non detachable. It's only detachable on one side. So you can't really detach it there. Such a cute, cute bag. Um, so <laughs> the reason I chose this particular animation um, is because my totem is lion. So <laughs> I just thought, you know, made it all sentimental and everything. So, um, yeah. And I guess these are like African animals. So that's another thing that I was attracted to. Um, yeah. So my totem is right there and I am proud to own this. Um, that's why I've been trying to preserve it and not abuse it or use it too much because I don't want it to to get ruined. I'm sure you want to know <laughs> how much this is. It is um, 485 on the Louis Vuitton website. Um, that's in Australian dollars. And I know there's been a price increase. So I'm trying to remember how much I paid for this back then. Um, it was probably in the 300s. 485 Australian dollars is not a pretty penny, okay? It's still expensive for a small little bag. If you think 485 is too much, just give it a little while and they're gonna increase the price again, okay? Louis Vuitton, among other brands, they're constantly increasing their prices. So I would say, if you wanted to own something from Louis Vuitton, just buy it. I know it's expensive, but you might as well buy it now because the price is gonna increase, okay? We can't stop it. It is the way it is. I would say if you buy this, then you're safe. And 
In the future, if the price does increase and you choose to sell your SLG or whatever you choose to sell that's from Louis Vuitton, you will get a little bit of extra money um, for it. Especially these limited editions, you know, they might go in demand. I still plan on getting just the classic uh, Demi Arabin, um, just because I like that print now. My first love was the monogram, but um, I'm really liking Demi Arabin. The monogram is kind of, you know, very popular, well known from the bet anybody who even doesn't own anything Louis Vuitton will be able to tell that this is Louis Vuitton but if you get like Demi Urbin or the Azor print you can kind of you know blend in a little bit hmm. um I mean I can't make up my mind about what uh, which one I like um which print do you like? Um, I have the Demir Bin print in the Speedy 30 and I love that. I love that. I will have to do a review. Um, I mean, if you're interested in that. And I also um, have the 25 um, size Speedy and I really like that one too. All their prints are nice. I mean, what do you think, hey? Anyway, that's my um, limited edition mini pochette. There are so many other Louis Vuitton small leather goods that I really want to collect. Um, I mean, you gotta start somewhere. Um, I want more of the toiletry pouches, you know, these different types. It is so cute. I am so glad I got this. I, if I never get another mini pochette, I am satisfied with just this one. But am I, am I? <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, that's it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like it and leave me a comment in the comment section. I will see you in my next video, okay? Bye.